clearly, if we can just get out of the way first, uh, Ambassador Berry, and I know you're in a difficult position because uh, you are the ambassador, but um, I'm sure everybody here wants to know what you think uh, about the political <laughs> contest uh, and about what the outcome might be and how we got here. So if you could just basically just lay that out for us, we can get that over and done with. <laughs> Michael, thank you for the opportunity. I, I was telling Michael beforehand that, uh, you know, at the movie theater, you sometimes debate whether to spend the extra money for the refillable bucket of popcorn. <laughs> and uh, this is one of those times where it's worth the investment because this will be entertaining to the very end, I promise you. <laughs> it's important to remember that what you're seeing now does not reflect the majority of the American public in any sense. In the North, uh, we're coming into the spring-summer season in the North. Just like it, it would be, uh, Australians would not pay much attention to politics in January. Americans wouldn't pay much attention to it in July or August either. Mm -hmm. At the end of Northern summer is our last summer holiday is called Labor Day. It is when most Americans come back from the beach and back from school holiday and they start to realize, oh gosh, I've got to start thinking about who I'm going to vote. Yeah. And it is not until that point that the clear majority of the country starts to fully engage. They're obviously aware, you can't ignore it. it you know, if I could take one, if I had a magic wand to take one package gift home from, the, from Australia back to the United States with me, and uh, it would be this, and it would be your mandatory voting system. <laughs> And the reason why is, just like Australia, America, the bulk of our population sits smack in the middle. They want a government that does good work, that does it with integrity, and is honest, and, and, and can be trusted. Keep in mind that big majority is not showing up on primary day. That's right. It will show up on election day which is the first Tuesday after the first Monday in November this year. That happens to be November 8th. And that's when you will see that big middle of the American electorate show up. And that's when you can judge the American populace. And uh, so I would, I would uh, ask you to keep your powder dry in terms of uh, your conclusions until you get to November 8th. And then just put in the back of your mind that Labor Day holiday. After September is really when most Americans really start to pay attention to what every word's being said and, and make their personal judgments.